what is the output of this Java program? Well, this kind of tricky coding questions you may get in a Java interviews. So here is the main class. It contains four overloaded print methods. And here is the main method which is the entry point for this program. And here the object of the main class is created and print method is get called. So this is an example for method overloading or a compile time polymorphism. So at a compilation time, the Java compiler will determine which print method it have to call based on the argument type. So here is basically the order. Java compiler will first look for the int primitive type and then long primitive type and then integer wrapper class and then variable argument. Well, if I run this program, it should call the print method it takes integer type as an argument. Okay. Next, if I comment out this and if I rerun the program, it should call the print method it takes long type. Okay. So basically the Java compiler will choose the appropriate method at a compile time based on the type of the argument passed during the method invocation.